season two? Are they going to go with What If Dark from the comics? Probably not. Nah. I don't know what they're gonna. I don't know what they're gonna do. I mean, the What If series is just. It's just. They did tie like like you know well, how many episodes? I can't remember how many episodes though. But like five you know, four or, or five of them did. They were yeah, they were so like four of them were supposed to tie in all together so they could have the last two episodes that they did. I did appreciate all Tron Prime. I thought that was pretty cool. I'm pretty that, sure that it's only like MCU. I don't know what they're gonna do. Oh yeah, they, it's only they MCU, have plenty of examples of, of of different what if issues to pick up. I don't know what they're gonna do. But they're not using that what if it's only MCU. None of none of them were like actual yeah, what if comics, what right? If. Were there any actual what if comics that they adapted into the Disney Plus series? No, it was just all MCU events. Yeah, just mismatched. Yeah. They yep. should have went all yeah. out. Yeah. The only thing that yeah. was different was Marvel Zombies, but all it was was just MCU but zombies. And, and they didn't even do it right. Oh, like, was they didn't do the what if storyline right. Right. Yeah, they did. Like, like what if like a true what if story to me is something like cool like. Something that could have actually happened, like, <laughs> like what if Thanos won or something like that? I don't know. Like in the final battle of Endgame, what if he won that battle? They, they did. Like, what if uh, Ultron won? I was like, that was yeah. the best episode. That was the best. Yeah, that's it. Ultron. That's yeah. it. Ultron one was cool though. Um, that one felt I, believable. I mean, like, sure, like it could have actually happened. Like. Imagine if they give us what if the X Men was at the first uh, battle of Avengers instead exactly. of Exactly. Like something like that would be cool. That could have been crazy. Dude. Like, but they didn't have the to that though. Aren't they all going to get together? Still. Is that how every What If series ends with them all getting back together? I don't know, maybe. Not everyone, but a few of them, yeah. I, I would want to see What If Dark, and then they got Fantastic Four characters. That first issue of What If Dark with uh the, the Venom symbiote getting a hold of Oh, yeah, that was good. That was good with Reed Richards. Yeah, and they threw in the um, um the professor that was the uh, lizard from Spider-Man. Yeah. That was oh, really nice. Good. People like, aren't gonna be ready for that. And then I, I can't wait to read yeah. the Moon Knight uh, this week. I'm gonna read the the, the uh, issue two this week. Yeah. See what that's hitting for. Oh, I forgot about that Moon Knight series. Those yeah, ones have actually been really, really good. The dark ones. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Hopefully, I'm they sure. continue to do more dark stuff. That and the freaking um Death of the uh, Venomverse. That's I haven't the... read that one. You're getting a little ahead of ourselves on that. That's still Sony. Maybe I'm doing nothing like that anytime soon. I, I wouldn't be surprised, man. They're gonna run out of characters soon enough. I didn't know there's no, Sony know. might do something like that, but I mean Marvel, uh, I ain't got nothing slated. They, they still gotta Sony drop notes so before stupid, they can do man. anything. 